a few days ago I have published this circuit and uh, another circuit more recently uh, with a kind of adaptation to this circuit. It's a circuit from an inverter or a two transistor Darlington driver from a uh, transformer. And in the first video I have showed the principles, in the second video I've made a more or less better circuit. And in this video I uh, want to use a very uh, big transformer to show that this circuit always works, but uh, that always does not mean that it always has the same properties, the same frequency, etc. Um, I have put out here in this circuit now, this circuit, the 47 nanofarad capacitor. So I took it away, and here we see how a noble gas lamp lights up on um, this frequency. Perhaps it's not a noble gas lamp. Uh, I had some criticism because here indeed there is uh, mercury inside etc etc. Uh, but in fact uh, I wanted to show the principles and when you use a transformer like this is a very big core you will see that the frequency uh, goes down substantially. It's now uh, 5 Hertz approximately with this transformer. It's a free running oscillator so all the properties uh, from the oscillator are set by the components. And in this um, uh, circuit the most important components that, that decide about the frequency is the transformer with this big core that cannot handle uh, uh, quickly changes on the magnetic field. This material for instance, ferrite, ferrite core, has very tiny uh, iron particles embedded in a ceramic layer and these tiny uh, ferrite particles can move very quickly so they have a very good high frequency um, property. This is exactly the same. So ferrite has better properties for higher frequencies compared to the very uh, low and um, core, laminated core um, for this frequency. You're going to listen now to the frequency. And this is the waveform at the moment. You can see that there are a lot of bursts of signal, very unstable. Uh, uh, different frequencies are present at the same time. So that's what this uh, circuit does with this transformer. This big uh, transformer has a very high inductance. And of course you can see that the light from the lamp also flickers. That has to do with the very low and instable fre uh, frequency from this circuit. So when you want to make such a circuit, use a um, um, laminated core transformer like this. This works much better, much better because it's small. Big transformers uh, relate to a very low frequency where it all works. And that does not have um, the ideal property for uh, such a noble gas lamp. 6.2 volts, 
approximately 600 milliamperes takes the circuit and it does not work so well. 